Hello, my fellow synesthesians and synesthesia enthusiasts. Today, I'm doing part two of making sims based off of my synesthesia. What is synesthesia, you ask? Synesthesia is basically an anomalous blending of the senses. Some people can even hear colors and taste colors, but today we're focusing on my type of synesthesia, which is grapheme color synesthesia. Basically, I see letters, numbers, and symbols in a specific color. If you want a more in-depth explanation, then feel free to go watch the first part of the series. So here I have a wheel with my strongest letter to number color associations. So for me, O is blue, and O is also two, and two is also blue. That rhymes. Same deal with T, A, M, I, and E. Let's say we land on yellow, which is I and four. Obviously, we're gonna make our sim dressed in all yellow. Their name has to start with an I, and I can only use four pieces for their outfit. This is not including hair, makeup, nails. This does include accessories, tops, bottoms, and shoes. So I am dreading the day that I land on A. All right, let's go ahead and spin. I, I think we got, yes. All right, so here is I. She looks pretty cute. Ines Irving. So I always imagined I to be pretty lonely and just shy in general and very like studious. So I guess we could do bookworm. Let me give her some hair. I could see the letter I wearing this hairstyle. Unfortunately, this yellow color is a menace, but I'm gonna have to use it. Let's actually start the outfit now. We have four pieces that we can use. I'm looking for a polo dress right now. Something like this. Oh, you know what? This looks good. Oh, this one's good, but it's really baggy. Let's do shoes. Wait, these would do two. Okay, so I'm gonna have to use the next two pieces very wisely. I'm thinking of some socks, something like this. That's really cute. Wait, I just realized I think I would have to make the socks yellow. For now, I'm gonna go with these yellow socks. Let me do her nails yellow. And I'm also gonna do her makeup. I don't know if this letter would really wear much makeup. Ooh, I quite like that. I'm taking back the socks. We need these white ones. That's much better. And I need to give her one more thing. And that thing is gonna be glasses. I quite like these. They're yellow and white. And there we go. There's Inez Irving, aka the letter yellow. I mean, <laughs> the letter I. I'm getting kind of worried for E, O, and A since that sim was pretty simple. It wasn't that bad, but... No! Why did I do this to myself? So here we have A. I'm just not looking forward to this. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. So for now, we're gonna go with this hair. I was trying to look for something interesting so it might add something to the look since we don't have many options. Obviously, we have to go with a full body outfit. I'm not super worried about the outfit itself because there's some pretty cute stuff here. I'm worried about the feet. She's not gonna have any shoes on, but we'll worry about that when we get there. All right, so I think this is actually a wonderful option. It looks like she has a ton of stuff on, but she just has a full body outfit, which counts as our one piece for the outfit. Let's do her nails, toenails as well, because she's gonna have them out, and the makeup. So cute. All right, makeup is finished. And unfortunately, that is it for the sim. I feel like if she had shoes, the outfit would at least be completed, but gotta follow the challenge. Oh, and I totally forgot her name. I'm gonna name her Ava Aarons. Self-assured, romantic, and hot-headed. I'm ready. Let's go ahead and spin. Okay, yes, eight. Eight pieces, awesome. All right, so this is the sim we're gonna be using for purple. I've named them Taylor Thomas and gave them purple traits. Let's give them some purple eyes and 
For the hair, I'm stuck between this one and this one. I think I'm gonna go with this one since it's more purple and it's so cool. I recently went CC shopping for male sims, so we have a lot to work with. Ooh, this one is so cool. We'll pair it with these shorts. And let's do some shoes. Should we do Crocs? Like, would Crocs and some socks look weird? I think it looks fine. I do want to give them a leg tattoo, so that counts as one of our pieces for the outfit. Let's do their nails. I like these. Let me see if I can sneak a little necklace under here. That works. And let's go ahead and do their makeup. Makeup is done and they are looking absolutely stunning. Now we just need two more things. So I'm gonna go ahead and add some piercings. Ooh, this one's cute. And this nose ring. And there we go. That is our purple sim. This has got to be my favorite so far. We're gonna spin one more time. I am nervous. E. All right, here's the very last scent. We can name him Eddie Edwards. There we go. He can have the outgoing trait, the self-assured trait, and clumsy trait. I'm gonna go with this hair. I like this. I don't really like that it's a different shade of green. <gasps> cute! That is so cute! Okay, this is getting very messy because at this point, we have three different shades of green, which means I have to remove the top or maybe the hair. Let me actually look for a full body outfit since I totally forgot we only have three pieces to use for his outfit. Hey, that's a cute item. I had no clue that Get Famous came with this. All right, we've got no luck. There's nothing really interesting here other than the really cute Yamachan. My dreams of using that jacket have dwindled. Hey, this is kind of cute. I've changed his hair for the 77th time and now I'm looking for shoes. These work. All right, and that sim is done. So that is the end of the video. I really, really hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Comment down below which sim was your favorite. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day, and I will see you later. Thank <music> you.